We're taking the city. Meet the soldiers gathering for the attack. Move it! All right! Yeah! It's time to deliver the final blow to the Stormcloak Rebellion! You have all fought bravely and sacrificed much to bring us to this point. But we will fight our way in and drag him out through the rubble to face justice! Because this is the end for them, the storm clothes! They will be fierce and crafty! But they are no match for Legionnaires! You are the best and the brightest warriors in Tamriel! Professional soldiers! Fearless and devastating! The Emperor will be paying close attention to what happens here today. Men who distinguish themselves will be well rewarded. Ready now? Yeah! Everyone with me! For the Empire! For the Legion! Uh -huh. Who's Stop! 
Stormcloak, you are guilty of insurrection, murder of imperial citizens, the assassination of King Torik, and high treason against the Empire. It's over. Not while I'm still breathing, it's not. Step aside, Galmar. We're here to accept Ulfric's surrender. I'll never surrender Skyrim into the hands of a corrupt and dying Empire. Skyrim doesn't belong to you, Ulfric. No, but I belong to her. Enough! You are traitors and will die traitors' deaths. Stand down and face public execution. Or advance and face summary execution by my hands. It matters little to me. Either way, I'll be sending your heads back to Cyrodiil. Well, what are we waiting for? Dragonborn be the one to do it. It'll make for a better song. Song or not, I just want it done. Here, use my sword to do it. I made sure to sharpen it for the occasion. Was that Liggett? Nothing. Just saying goodbye. Well, the men will be expecting some kind of speech. 
And we'll need to hand the city over to that free winter fellow. Runwolf, yes, I've sent men to protect him and bring him here. Windhelm will need a government quickly if we are to prevent more violence. The Legion will be staying here for quite some time. I don't expect there to be any further violence. Oh, and Leggett. It's been an honor to have you at my side. As a token of my appreciation, I want you to keep my sword. And now to deliver a speech. is over. Ulfric Stormcloak is dead. His head will be sent to Cyrodiil, where it will adorn a spike on the walls of the Imperial City. Let this day be a final warning to all who would still call themselves Stormcloaks. We are turning the city over to Brunwolf Freewinter, an honorable and faithful man. Many of you will be staying in Windhelm to aid the Jarl in restoring order and stamping out any embers of rebellion that may still smolder here. In appreciation for your exemplary service, I am doubling your pay and compensation to the widows of your fallen comrades. I am proud of all of you. All hail the Emperor. I hate giving speeches. It wasn't so bad. I hope we haven't just created There's bound to be resistance. There are many Stormcloak camps tucked away in the hills. They'll no doubt strike whenever and wherever they can. But without Ulfric to inflame their passions, they'll settle down and return to their homes eventually. I pray you're right, Lady. In the meantime, we'll continue to root them out and put them to the sword. We couldn't have done this without you. The Empire glories in your accomplishments. Come, Rika. There's still much to be done. It's always good to see someone I can count on. Sometimes I wonder if the gods have abandoned us, as we have abandoned them. There are those who still call themselves Stormcloaks, who continue to fight us and bring misery to the people, but they are few in number. The ordinary citizen will be happy to get back to life as normal, to have their families return home, and they should enjoy it while they can. I suspect all of Tamriel will again be called to arms in the not-too-distant future. The Legion's work is far from finished, but you are free to roam. I suspect you'll be of greater good to Skyrim out there, in the world. If, while you're out there, you stumble into any Stormcloak military camps, I expect you to destroy them. I've reports they are hiding in the hills. The Generals put me in charge of assisting the new governments. I may understand things here in Skyrim better than the general, but I'm a soldier at heart, not a politician, but I'll do my best. This is the land of my birth, the land that shaped me. I'm proud to have any part in making it strong again. Mm-hmm.